Hey YouTube, what's up? Blue Witch here. So now I'm gonna be, what happened? Hmm. I hope that's better. I'm doing a beautiful, one of my favorite fish vanishing castings. I have this beautiful fish. You can see here. Yes, quite lovely. So is what I'm going to be doing is stuffing this fish with this bitch and then I will be banishing her. I'm going to bind her to the fish. I'm going to bind her and banish her and throw her, cast her into the river. I command that she leave my client and her boyfriend alone. Yep, that's what we're going to do. We want her gone once and for all. She keeps coming back. And we're just so tired of her. We get rid of her. And she comes back around again. So, this time, we are going to banish her in the fish. Yes, we are. Bring my glasses on. See, <gasps> this is for TT painting. TT, this is for you, daughter. Okay, this is a huge picture of her, I know. But that's okay. I am going to roll her up. Where is my nasty? I have two trays here. I want her on this one right here for now. And then I have my nasty um doom oil. It's really disgusting. Yeah. And I'm going to put it on her with my doom powder. And I'm going to write a petition saying I want her to go away. Here's my petition right here. My vanishing fish. And. She is a nuisance. And of course, you know, when you have gloves on and Nikki stuff on your hand and then your nose starts to tickle. Of course. Okay, let me see, where was I? Where's my string? So I'm gonna be using red string because I want to bind her to this curse. I wanna bind her to the fish and then, and I wanna bind her from interfering in my client's relationship and I bind, and then I'm banishing her into, into 
the river. Okay, so that is why I'm going to be using the red string with this. I think usually I use black, but I'm going to be using red because I'm because I don't want her coming back. I want her to go and stay away and stay gone and don't come back. You never want to see her ugly face again. I'm going to do a kate sigil. This far. Oh, It's so cold here, you guys. I know some of you have it worse than me, but I think it's like five degrees here right now. It's way too cold. Way too cold for Blue Witch. Oh my goodness. Okay, so now I gotta get my finger out of here so I can get some, some blood to activate the sigil. Lucifer, I call upon you. Oh, yeah. I ask for your assistance in banishing this bitch. Get rid of her. Keep her out of. And her boyfriend. Keep her away from. Boyfriend. Keep her out of her life. She's a nuisance. We want her gone. Please assist. In the name of the trident, I command her to be banished. In the name of the Kate Lucifer and I command her gone and banished from the lives of. Okay. I banish you. I command you go. to use my velvet candles for curses a lot. Okay. 
we have it. Now this is going to go on the outside of her. And then I'm going to put my Doom Powder. Notice I'm avoiding opening this nasty as long as I can. So gross. So gross. So these are poisons that will not hurt nature. I would never put something in the river that was going to harm any living creature. I just want to make that clear to you guys. I'm not that kind of witch. I am not going to throw anything in the river ever that is going to hurt fish or hurt any kind of wildlife. I love wildlife and I would never, ever, ever do that. Um, I don't care. There's no way it would never happen. So I just like to make sure that you guys understand that it's not okay to do things like that. Um, and I would never do it. So into the fish you go. You nasty ho. Okay. Now... I'm going to go ahead and bring this nasty stuff out. If I can, maybe I will be able to use it. Oh, 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 oh. oh shucks. It opened. Okay. Now, I'm going to pour. And this stuff won't hurt. This will not hurt fish either. It's like um, heart, like chicken hearts and oh, nasty things like that. There's some vinegar and oils and things, different different kinds of stuff like that in there that are good for banishing, you know, spells. All right, let's hurry and put this lid back on there. Whew. Oh my. Okay. Okay, now we're going to get our string. I bind you to this fish. I bind you to this curse. I command that you go, that you are banished from their lives, that you will no longer interfere with their relationship. I bind you to this curse, and I banish you from their lives, that you will never come back around them again. You are banished from them. You must stay gone. Get away from their lives. Stop interfering in their relationship. I command that you go. I bind you to this curse. And I banish you from their lives. So mote it be. tie this knot. I seal your fate. As I tie this knot, your fate is sealed. what I will do with this fish now is I will burn a couple of candles on it. I'm going to start with this one right here. I'm going to put it right up here. Right here. And um, I'm going to put it down here. There you go. I'm going to burn a few candles on it. I have some, um, some special plaques 
Well, we call them medallions. They're big wooden things with sigils on them. They're about yay big over here. And um, I like to put my spells on them. Um, and so I'm going to be putting this, I don't know, maybe, I think I'll put it in front of this stellar mirror. Um, I think that the spirits will really, the gods will really like it over there, I think. So I'm going to go ahead and put it over there for a few days and burn candles on it for a few days. And then I will drive it down to the river. It's really cold right now this time of year. It's not, a, not the best time of year to put it to do offerings into the river, but I um, have lots of different options. Um, where I live, I'm really fortunate like that. I have many options to, um, you know, throw the fish. And it'll be good food for, like, the salmon and things like that. They can eat it. Um, the bears can get it and eat it and, and, um, you know, it'll feed off of many things. Many things will feed off of it and that's good. That's more energy, the water, the river, everything will put energy into it. And so it's very effective. Um, I've done this spell a few times before and it's always worked. I have never had it not work. And so I love to do it um, because not it's a good offering to the to nature and to the river when you're throwing your spells out. Um, always always do so with an offering, and the fish is not only part of the spell but it's also an awesome offering, and so it's brilliant. And um, and I'm so happy that my client. Um, wanted to do this spell. So that is it for tonight, you guys. And tomorrow I will be um, working on some videos. I need to talk about a breakup spell. I'm going to do a breakup spell video to talk about what to expect and how to handle the energy and stuff. And I'm going to do a um, prosperity. And I might I'm considering doing a spell on time, um, on why it takes some spells a bunch, you know, a long time and other people can happen the next day and things like that. And, but I'm going to have to do some meditation on that one and take some notes. There's so many reasons and so many things that change that can change things and turn things around. There are things that people do to, to block spells. I mean, I don't know. It's hard to explain. And so that's why I'm going to have to like really meditate with Akate and Lucifer and, and Beliel and ask them for, to help me like word it correctly. Um, and so that I could be clear in the video and give you guys the best information that I can give you. Anyways, that's it for tonight. It's so cold out here. And I mean, I have my fire going tonight. And so it's not too bad inside here, but it is, it's really cold. <laughs> so I love you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, for some videos and then this coming week I think I have some love spells coming I have a prosperity coming um, I have a couple of love spells I think that I get to that I get to do and I'm so excited about it I love doing love spells some beautiful I went and select I went to the market today or well, I went yesterday actually and selected some beautiful, big green, gorgeous apples to do my spells in. Sometimes I like to use the green apples because it reminds me of the kate, and so I like it. Anyways, I'm out of here. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Bye.